When I was in Hong Kong, I am a secretary secretary. So uh, I work in a Crown Corporation in a corporate affair department. But on my voluntary basis, uh, I also involve a lot in my church. Uh, I remember in 1995, uh, our church decided to go to a, uh, a grassroots community to start uh, uh, a, ch a church planting. I have a uh, calling that I should go to involve in this project. So I go into the community and uh, I visit the family every Saturday. I visit them, I talk to them, I have a very great compassion on them. Uh, I find that they have a lot of problems. I always go to seek help from my friend, she's a social worker. I always ask her, how can I help them? They have no money. So I really want to do something to help these people. Yeah, but because I'm an executive secretary, so I don't know what I can do. And so at that time, I suddenly have a calling. I thought, oh, maybe I should study something to do something that I can come back to help this, this group of people. And so then I start my uh, school searching process. And I'm thinking, oh, maybe I can go to U.S. or to Canada, to anywhere I'm open. Uh, I came to Canada in 1996, uh, October 12th. But you know, being an um, immigrant at that time is not easy totally not easy. So I work in a travel agency, so part-time, uh, actually full-time. Uh, I, I go to school in the morning, at lunch hour, and in the evening. So I squeeze everything. Um, but after six years, so I finish, I graduate. At that, in the last year of my uh, study, I, I start asking myself, Daisy, what do you want to do? I, I get lost when I'm studying because everyone telling me, okay, you should do this. Uh, maybe you should take like international business or maybe marketing or a lot of voices. But suddenly at that point, I, I remember why you come to Canada. I know my passion. I know my passion is not working in a bank, is not working in a mutual fund company. I want to help those people. So at that point, suddenly I hear from the radio the first time about employment counseling. Oh, I said, yes, that's right. That's what I want to do. I started a college program. Uh, another college program for two years is uh, employment counseling. So um, in that, over that period, I also volunteered in two uh, immigration agencies. So Mosaic is the one I'm working now. So I found that I can help those people. Uh, and through the volunteering, I can contribute a lot. When I'm working in at Mosaic, uh, the first two years, I work in a community assistance program. So I help multi barriers client because they are, they, they, they are facing many, many like, challenges and barriers. So I, uh, they are low income, they depend on welfare, they have very low English, and also they don't have a job. So I teach them pre-employment uh, uh, pre skills, and also life skills. I always use my story to encourage them. I believe that the path I went through will have a purpose. So I know that my story can help them. And I always tell them, okay, um, don't give up. If I want to give up, I have hundreds of reasons to give up. I didn't because I know that I have to fulfill my dream.